Apparently, a brand new Pokemon game is going to be announced in early 2024, probably the next Pokemon Presents, which will be around February of 2024, which is only like three months away. That's really not too far at all. And this is not going to be like a full-on Pokemon Presents prediction video, but more so like what is a possible game for them to announce? Like, there are a lot of rumors and a lot of leaks and speculation going on right now. There's also a lot of hints throughout Scarlet and Violet, and especially with the new Indigo Disc DLC, which is coming out in just a few weeks, I think. I think about a week or two. Some people have been actually able to play the DLC a little bit early, and they claim that it's actually connected to the Unova region, so there's like a pretty big connection to Scarlet and Violet to Generation 5 or the Unova region, which is actually really, really cool. Also, really quickly, guys, once I hit 10,000 subs, I'm going to be giving away a $20 Nintendo eShop gift card. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is like the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for future videos. And then when I hit 10,000 subs, I'll be announcing that giveaway winner. So Central Leaks from Twitter or X, whatever, he posted a tweet and said that the next Pokemon game will be revealed in 2024, but it's not Generation 10, which makes total sense because Generation 9 is, you know, just came out. That's the newest Pokemon game. But there will be a Pokemon game announced next year. It's unknown if that's a mainline game, if it's a remake, if it's just like a Legends game, like a side a side game, but also like a mainline game, if, if that makes sense. Like, like Pokemon Legends Arceus is a mainline game, but it's not like the typical mainline game, I guess, if that makes sense. I honestly really feel like they're going to release another Legends game or announce it. And I think they might either announce another Legends game that takes place in the past, or one that takes place in the future, like a Paradox Legends game, if that makes sense. Hopefully it's with Generation 5. That's what I hope, that's what most people in the community are hoping, because Generation 5 is such a cool region. It's next up for remakes, which, you know, it's obviously confirmed that we're going to get remakes eventually of Gen 5, of Pokemon Black and White. I wonder how they're going to actually go about doing that, though. Like, I wonder if... The black and white remake is going to be a remake that includes black and white 1 and black and white 2 or if it's just going to be a remake of black and white 1 and then black and white 2 remakes come after that that's for a whole nother video that's a whole nother topic but just something to think about generation 5 is personally my favorite generation i like the 3d slash 2d graphic how you know the graphic style they had i'm really bad at remembering the specific terms of like style of graphics but I really like the animation styles in that game. I really like the Pokemon. I feel like the Pokemon in that generation are great. The storyline is amazing. There's also lore connected with Black and White or Generation 5 or, you know, Region, whatever. So I'm really, really hoping for a Generation 5 remake or a Generation 5 Legends game or Paradox game or just a game where you travel into the past and the future which within Generation 5. And honestly, the main reason why people are thinking this is just because of all the hype about black and white you know region being next and all the leaks or rumors or things in scarlet and violet hinting slash suggesting towards something generation 5 based and it could also be nothing it could literally just be as simple as the indigo disc dlc is going to be connected to the you know region that could literally be it riddler q also tweeted yesterday um 2024 prediction and we got the kanto map or kanto we got johto unova and then you know, Scarlet and Violet. So I don't really know exactly what that means. I don't know if Riddler Q actually knows what's going on or what's going to be announced, but something hopefully is going on with Generation 5. I also made a video recently about the possibility of us getting a remake of Generation 2, which also would be awesome. And I know we already have Heart Gold and Soul Silver, but I'm talking about like a Let's Go style remake. That was what my whole video was about. So that's a possibility, I guess, where their Q predicts that might happen. And he also brought up the Kanto map, which is interesting to me. I really have no idea. I wish there was more context to this. People in the comments just kind of say what they want as well. Who knows? Maybe there's going to be two games in 2024. Probably not because they recently said that they're going to slow down production just because they have been releasing a lot of games. I honestly hope they don't do two games in one year unless it unless they're like banger games like unless they're really really good something else that would also be interesting is if they gave us a game you know based on the cancer region or johto region that takes place after the events of the first game think of how black and white 2 is the second part of black and white imagine we went back back to those time eras with you know cancer or johto whatever 
and we get another game that adds on to that storyline. I'm not sure how they would do that because those games are old, the storyline, you know, closed. But there's always room to make new lore. I think with any story, you can always add something. Like, I don't think any story is completely done with just because that's what stories are. Stories are meant to have lore behind them, whether or not you go more into the future or go back into the past a little bit. I really think that would be neat. I'd love to explore Kanto or Johto again. Honestly, I have barely spent any time in the Johto region. I know another thing a lot of people talk about is like, let's go Mer Meryl or let's go Togepi or something like that. That'd be pretty cool. I think a let's go game for generation two would be really neat because it's been a long time since we've had a game based on generation two. Like I'm pretty sure the last one was Heart, Gold, and Soul Silver, which is like mid 2000s. That was a long time ago. I would really like to see that too. I hope it would be better than Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. And by that, I just mean like more features, maybe introduce some new features. Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee were really plain. I won't talk about that much more though. If you want to check my video out in the past, I made it a few days ago. I also saw somebody talking about like another part to Scarlet and Violet, like coming back to Scarlet and Violet again. Maybe there's going to be another DLC, which I don't know how true that would actually be like. That would be a little weird, but within Riddler Q's tweet, he brought Scarlet and Violet in that picture. Like, that was one of the four options he said for 2024 predictions. That would be kind of crazy if we went back to Scarlet and Violet again. Scarlet and Violet are great games. Like, they're super, super fun. They have so much lag still, which is really unfortunate, but they're really fun games. I wouldn't mind having another part to Scarlet and Violet, honestly. I think it would make the game a lot more enjoyable. Especially because I felt like I played through this game so quick because it was so fun. I beat the game within a week or so, and then I just kind of didn't play it for a long time, pretty much until the Scarlet and Violet DLC came out. Adding on to that lore would be a little interesting, but I also hope that they would do that as well as give us a new game. Like, I hope 2024 is not just another part to Scarlet and Violet. I honestly don't think that they're going to go back to the Kanto region just because we went back to the Kanto region with uh, Let's Go Eevee and Let's Go Pikachu, which was, I mean, it was already about six years ago, but that's relatively recent if you think of like the whole grand timeline of all Pokemon games, I guess. I don't think we're going to revisit Gen 1 for a while unless they give us a Legends game based on it. Um, so I'd say it's more so likely that in 2024, Pokemon Presents, we're going to get an announcement of a Gen 2 remake or a Gen 2 Let's Go style, maybe a Let's Go open world, or maybe a Gen 2 open world Legend style game, or we're going to get a Legend style game for Generation 5 with maybe some connections to Scarlet and Violet, like maybe a Generation 5 Paradox Legends game or a Past Legends game where a little bit takes place in 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 the scarlet and violet region a little bit i think that would be a little interesting something to do with the blueberry academy i think it would be really awesome to get gen 5 though let me know what you guys think i know most people want generation 5 and then generation 2 like those are the two big generations that people want next and then of course generation 10 but i also made a video about that that's probably going to release around 2026 2027 so we're a few years away from generation 10 Hope you guys enjoyed this video though, if you did make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.